Welcome to the first episode of the Cedrica series. Today we are going to walk you through the computer vision subsystem. What do you think is the most important thing to do while driving a car? It is to notice one's surroundings. The eyes of the driver detect roads, people, other vehicles and so on. In self-driving cars, this job is done by cameras. The computer vision subsystem of Cedrica works on these captured images and makes interpretations. The images taken by the cameras are sent to the convolutional neural network. This network carries out three main tasks. Task 1, segmentation. The image from the cameras is broken down into pixels. The network gives an output marking which pixels are lanes and which are not. Task 2, object detection. This detects pedestrians and nearby cars in the same way. Task 3, classification. This identifies the color of traffic lights and detects road signs. At present we are trying to combine these three tasks into a single network. This is called multitask learning. Now how exactly does this network understand what we are showing it? The network requires training for this. We show the network lots of inputs and it maps these to outputs. The more images it sees, the better it retains. This method is called backpropagation. Team Cedrica is now aiming to build a fully autonomous vehicle for the intelligent ground vehicle challenge of 2023. The computer vision subsystem will play the vital role of detecting the vehicle surroundings and identifying obstacles for this challenge so that the car stays on course. That was all about how the computer vision subsystem contributes to autonomous vehicles. We'll see you in the next episode of the Cedrica series.